what's poppin'? All right, fam. All right, Bob checking in here. And uh, I think we have a lot to discuss. Now, let's jump right into it. First off, salute the notification guy hitting that like button. Before we even start, y'all, the real. All right, fam, salute. In the way, oh, first, we got that boy, Ush. Hey, man, say, man, bro. Now, that boy, Usher, been getting dragged through the mud for the past few weeks, fam, for allegedly passing around herpes like a blunt in rotation. Now, the first woman that spoke out, she confronted Usher before things got out of hand. She told Usher she started getting blisters around that box, and we all know ain't no damn blister supposed to be there. When she confronted Usher with the matter, Usher said, I ain't got nothing, but Usher finally decided to go to the doctor. And guess what? He found out he's in no symptomatic carrier, which means he's infected, but he don't show any physical traits. And that's when that boy Usher decided to pay her $1.1 million of that good old hush money. Once this news broke, another woman came forward. She was suing Usher for $10 million for exposing her to the STD. But the woman decided to go to the doctor and she found out she had herpes, bruh. So she upped the bag. She went from asking for 10 million to 20 million dollars, fam. Now, as soon as that second woman came forward, that's when Black China lawyer stepped in and encouraged other people that been with Usher to speak out. And uh, dang, it's more the same, bruh, because three new individuals done came forward saying they gonna file a lawsuit, bruh. Now, each of these individuals claiming that Usher exposed them to the STD. Attorney Lisa Boone says she will file a suit Monday in California and hold a news conference in NYC to correspond with the filing. One woman will appear at the news conference. The rest will stay anonymous. Now, this what got this situation looking even crazier, bro. It's two women in this situation, and the last person is a man, bro. Now, peep this. All three individuals claim to have had sexual contact with Usher after 2012, and he failed to warn them he allegedly had herpes. Now, we still gonna say allegedly because we still gotta hear Usher's side of the situation, but things is looking crazy, bruh. And to be honest with y'all, I think more people gonna come forward as time go on. Now, Usher's wife has decided to stick by him. She claimed everything is a fluke and everybody is out to sabotage Usher, but y'all can think differently. Y'all, comment down below. What do y'all think about this entire situation? Anyone about to be out of here, sub to the channel if you haven't. Press that sub button. Also, press that bell beside it to get notification any time I drop a video. Follow me on Twitter. Link in the description. Follow me on IG at RelatableAutball. Salute to y'all, man. We on that one. 100K. Grind. Up, ball. Go.